okay so today topic name is installation of selenium jars and drivers okay. so to install these softwares okay so to install the softwares so we need to approach this selenium dot dev first follow the https colon double slash www dot selenium dot dev so this is the official link to download the selenium just okay. So to download the Selenium jars, we need to approach the browser. So here I'm approaching the Chrome browser. So inside the Chrome, I'm going for the HTTPS colon www dot selenium dot dev selenium dot dev. <coughs> so inside the selenium, so when we are launching the selenium official link, it was getting this about. So we need to download the jars. Click on it, downloads. Then we are getting a latest stable version. Latest stable version. So present Selenium was following 4.8.0 version. So click on the 4.8.0. So just a single tab. So you can observe here. So in like a left side bottom corner. So here it will downloading the Selenium server so mainly we can say jar file okay here you can see dot jar okay now so uh, now what we need to do means here scroll the page scroll the page down to browsers down to browsers we are seeing a browsers is the option click on the browsers now we are getting a driver version so so basically, I am following the two drivers. One is a Chrome. First one, I am going with the Chrome. Here you can see, in uh, like inside the Chrome, there is a documentation option. Option name is documentation. Click on the documentation. Now, so we are getting the two versions. So here we are getting that one is a beta release, and second one is a stable release. So uh, in manual testing, we are know about that beta is nothing but a in under construction. So in user acceptance testing, we are seeing that beta release. So beta is nothing but a under construction. So we required a stable release. So here we are seeing that latest stable release. So click on the latest stable release Chrome driver 110.0.5481 version. So click on this stable version so still the jar file also downloading here so when we are clicking on the stable version we are getting the four options one is a line here you can see chrome driver underscore linux chrome driver underscore mac underscore mac but our operating system is windows so chrome driver underscore windows 32 dot chip so here you can see one, two, three, fourth. Fourth option is Chrome driver underscore Windows 32 dot zip. Okay. So this is the zip file. So zip file means again we need to extract. Presently just click once here. So you can observe here. Here the zip file was downloaded. Okay. So it was around 6.8 MB. Okay. And you can see here. Still here, jar file will be downloading. So you can see 
still it was downloading so you can see here also so in downloads so still it was downloading now so chrome driver was downloaded successfully selenium server also downloaded successfully if you require to download chrome browser like firefox browser also then what you need to do means again go back to that browsers go back to the browsers here we are seeing the firefox documentation so click on the firefox documentation now now there is a geeko driver releases there is a geeko driver releases click on the geeko driver releases so we are getting a one page so here is the versions so which versions we need to follow means here is the checking the like operating system one is linux and second one is also linux and fourth one linux linux and mac os and here we are seeing that windows so we are getting that two options here windows purpose so you can see architecture 64 one is and windows 32 so we need to click on that windows 64.zip so click on that geeko driver Okay, now you can see here Geeko driver also downloading. Uh, it was around just KBs, it was around a 1.47 MB. okay now geeko driver also download okay so in this installation part geeko driver also download now minimize the page so here you can see uh, inside the files actually so it was found in a downloads so all downloads are found in a downloads page inside your file inside the files go to the downloads so here the option name is downloads so here you can say today we are downloaded that geeko driver uh, here is the chrome driver and selenium driver so yesterday we are downloaded that java and today uh, we are also downloaded that eclipse ide also so tomorrow it will be changing the path it will be changing the path so that's why what we need to do what we need to do means we need to separate this folders we need to support the softwares okay now for that purpose here i am approaching that so in my system here i available a l driver okay so uh, basically you are in your systems you are getting that uh, d drive or e drive you can prefer d drive or e drive open that low new volume like uh, c d drive or e drive and inside the driver create a new folder right click new and folder so this folder name you can get selenium software selenium selenium software selenium software okay so inside the cell here folder was successfully created so 
where our like uh, where our chrome driver and selenium was found inside the downloads inside the downloads so click on downloads so here is the three things now select these three things and write sorry select these three things and copy and then paste into selenium software paste into inside the selenium software right click and paste so total how many selenium software are there we are separated our folders inside the selenium software there is a three folders now here is the another problem so basically these folders are founding in the zip files we can't able to use these zip files that's why we need to extract these files right click and click on extract here so if you are using newly purchased laptops then you can see that option name is uh, the option name is extract all option name is extract all but you are still using old laptops we are getting a extract here option click on extract here we are getting a folder like this so this is the dot exe file we can see so you can see the logo we can observe the logo yeah uh, one second i am using the magnifier here so you can see so you can observe the difference here this is the zip file and this is the dot exe file it is a extracted file and this is the firefox zip file right click and then extract here now this is the geeko driver dot exe file firefox mainly follows geeko driver okay so now uh, success successfully we are installed selenium software so now we are completed the installation process of selenium software 